<laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So tonight we are having a little date night together. So me and Sean have been kindly gifted this lovely date night box from a company called Cupid Box. So inside here is meant to be a planned date night for you and whoever you want to spend your time with and you're having a date night um, it's just for parents and couples who don't get a chance to go out together like me and Sean we don't really get the time to go out together and spend time together we did I did take for a meal like two weeks ago yeah but most of the time we don't get time to spend no, together no like we finish work get home and just kind of like chill out like. and then literally go to bed and get up and go to work again so it's really nice that they have kindly sent us this so thank you so much for that and I'm now going to do an unboxing of their box. I think it's a Paris theme box. I'm not too sure though. So I will do an unboxing of that for you and we'll let you, well, take you along with us and see how we get on with the date. So we decided to make this proper date night and we have put some food in the oven. So we just put a pizza from Marks and Spencer's in there and <laughs> we're going to have some bubbles too. We got this from... My friend Rosie for my birthday. And we haven't opened it yet, so why not open it now? There he goes. What? <laughs> did, did. Hey. Celebration. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. So now we've got our bubbles ready. We're gonna do the unboxing. So, oh, here we go. So inside the box, just to show you, it looks like this. We have lots of different things to have a go at. So let's see what they've have a go. <laughs> let's see what they've sent us. Right. So I think this is instructions. Mm. So it says tonight is date night. Thank you for choosing Cupid Box for your date night this month. We know how hectic life can get sometimes and how quality time is often sacrificed. Don't forget to share your date night with using the hashtag CupidBoxDateNights. So, we've got loads of instructions. Yep, yeah, it is Paris that we are going to. So in here we've got the ooh la la language of love. Ooh, we've got two pens and some cards. We've got, I think Sean will be doing this because he's better than me paint set, oh a black spice soy candle, which is not focusing, there we go, and some pancakes, mm. smells good, smells good, some watercolour paints, a Notre Dame building, okay, and a dot to dot with the paintwork and just a few little one day in Paris date cards. So we are going to crack on with this date night. Yeah. You get free oh, stuff on that so you can mess with it if you want. All right. Did anyone tell you that Sean thinks he's a comedian? <laughs> and we'll see how we get on. So the first thing that we have to do is to get our pens and our blank compliment cards and take 10 minutes apart to write three things that we love about each other on them and then we have to hide them somewhere so that the other one can find them. Uh -huh. this map here of Paris and then we have each have a plan our date our day in Paris card and we have to fill in the blanks using the map and then compare them at the end to see if we both would like to go and see the same sites and 
to see if we've got like the same sort of things on each of the cards. Are you ready? This is very exciting. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. While Amy's doing uh, her card, because you can't really, you know, do it together because it defeats the object of the old uh, experience of Paris. I'm just going to keep drinking the champagne because it's rather nice. But, you know, we haven't been able to vlog as much lately because, if you didn't know, Eva had chicken pox. So, it's been, we had a challenging week with her, but she, she got over it, it was good. They always they say it's better to get it early, so that's a bit of time off work left after the poor little bunny. And her top teeth are now coming through. So, yeah, she's been, she, she hasn't, when her first two teeth come through, they, you know, she was she was crying a lot. I mean, a lot. But she doesn't seem that bad, to be honest. So, fingers crossed it stays that way. But I'm just making us some pizza and chips. Standard. From m and um, While Amy finishes this card. And, yeah. So the next activity is we have to pick a French pet name for each other off this... Um, Ooh la la, French card. So if you go then, Sean. Any of these? Yeah, you have to say it in French there. Alright. Mm. Mon chari. What's that? My darling. <laughs> I was going to say my wolf, but probably. My funny. wolf! I'm going to say. Ignore the mess. Mon... Your nose. What's that? My teddy bear. Hey! <laughs> You're really good at the French, French accent, Amy. Mon <laughs> <laughs> So our next activity is this dot to dot of this picture. So Sean's just getting on with that while I am getting the paints ready to obviously I think paint it from the instructions. So that should be fun because Sean absolutely loves painting. So we can do this together and it will be so nice. So mid mouthful, but we are just having some food, just finishing off. <laughs> hmm. Lovely, dining for ten pounds from Marquis. Did you forget the wine this time? No, Sean, it didn't come with the drink, <laughs> so I didn't forget the wine. <laughs> Sean likes to embarrass me because. I went in for the dining for two for twelve pound it is now with an alcoholic drink and I paid sixteen pound for it because I forgot to get the drink. <laughs> so it wasn't a dining meal, I just paid for everything separately because I didn't get the deal, the whole deal because I didn't get the drink. So Sean likes to take the mick out of me for doing that. But you know, I had a mum moment <laughs> brain. But yeah, so we are just finishing off this, as you can see, Sean has started the dot to dot, and I definitely think it's going to be Mona Lisa. Um, so he's got to finish that when he's finished stuffing his face. <laughs> um, and then we're going to paint it. So that should be fun. <laughs> finished well nearly finished his painting as you can see he's really enjoying that if you if you want to buy it it costs about 500 quid i'll leave the link below send it over <laughs> that's for his painting not the box <laughs> um, but yeah so i'm gonna leave it there just because i don't want to spoil the whole box thing i know i did an unboxing thing but i don't want to like spoil it for other people that want to purchase it if you do want to purchase it i'll leave all the links to cupid box dates below for you all and um, we've had a really really good time together it's been really nice and it's got us to do something different that we don't normally do which has been really nice obviously painting planning a day out in paris um been to paris baby yeah we've been to paris for the day for the <laughs> night um just planning our schedule and things like that writing some really nice notes on some cards for each other to find 
so that has been really really nice so thank you so much for gifting us this box i think we should give each other the free cards that we've written about each other go on then so these are the ones yeah, we've, we, we found them believe it or not we found them it was <laughs> hard to find them but we did but we've all written three things wrote it's, three things wrote three things that you have to say you are great to her go on then so we'll go one we'll go one for one we'll go one for one go on go then on. you start okay you provide all the laughs hey always good yeah funny guy yeah i've just put Oh, does it say? Is it? Oh, it's come the opposite way around. It does say bum. <laughs> great. I love a bum, it's great. Quite the romantic, isn't it? <laughs> Your eyes are the best. Yeah, oh, and I've put Amy's eyes are the best. Because they're oh. green and cute. And then last one I put, you always know how to make me feel on top of the world. Oh. <laughs> and I've got laugh. Because you've got a cute laugh. Oh, thanks. So, we've definitely had a really nice night and I hope you've all enjoyed this little vlog that we thought we'd do for Cupid Box Dates and I hope it has made you think about having a date night in like we did. I'll definitely leave all the links below for you but we're going to check out now. So, see you in yes. the next video, guys. See you, guys. It has been good. Go and get yourself one. It's something different. It does feel a bit like something really weird and different but we've had a nice night but now we're going to chill out see you in our next video guys bye bye, bye, -bye.